saw it and I screamed and I told my husband, I was like, babe, I've been approved. Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's your girl again, Yela Obijaku, and we are back again with another video. So today's video, just as the title says, you already know that your girl is finally monetized. Yay! Yes, guys, your girl is finally monetized. I'm sure you can tell from the title of this video. And I'm just going to talk about, you know, the whole monetization process, how long it took, and, you know, my journey so far on this YouTube street. So, guys, if you just see my face for the first time and you're here to subscribe to my channel, <laughs> now is the time to subscribe to my channel. Now is the time to subscribe to my channel. Subscribe to my channel while you're here. Turn on the bell. So you don't miss any post whenever it comes live on my channel and if you're an og and you have stopped getting my notification i would want you to do one thing for me right now and subscribe to my channel and subscribe back to my channel while you're watching this video and also turn on the bell that way you won't miss any new post whenever i post new video on my channel so guys <laughs> let us get into this video i opened a youtube channel in february 2015 i can't remember the exact day that i opened the youtube channel but i know it's february 2015 because my about section actually said so so my first video here on youtube was actually in 2015 but like i said in one of my videos that youtube doesn't have that record anymore because i actually deleted that video from my channel my first video here on youtube was four years ago and it was in 2016 and <laughs> that video actually currently has 131 views so in 2016 i only had one video uploaded so youtube for me started in 2016 as far as i'm concerned and i was you know i wasn't really doing so much on youtube fast forward to 2017 i tried a bit you know you know it wasn't really working i didn't know anything about seo i didn't know anything about tagging right i didn't know anything about you know um uploading quality content i was just all about sharing you know my love for makeup on my channel that was actually it for me and it kept on going like that i wasn't really doing so much on my youtube channel because <laughs> baby girl don't know anything anyways fast forward to 2018 i tried that was actually the year i tried you know to to put in a little more effort into my youtube channel compared to other years so i tried you know posting once a um i think i that was when i started the whole posting three times a week and you know i went off i came back on you know i kept on going off and on but 2018 was actually the year i told myself that I was going to you know pick up my youtube channel and that was actually the year that the whole um monetization threshold the new threshold for monetization actually changed because the requirements actually needed to be monetized on youtube you need to have up to 1000 subscribers and your watch time has to be 4000 watch hours and you should or any you shouldn't have any copyright strike on your channel or you shouldn't have gone against the youtube you know monetization policies or the community guidelines fast forward to february youtube changed the policy and everybody was going you know everybody was going crazy that was when i told myself that ah, man this four thousand watch hours there's no how it's not possible there's no how i can actually meet up in one year let me just keep doing what i know i, I do best as doing my makeup videos and also do more research and you know watch more videos and learn how to grow my channel you know better things, little things like that actually makes me feel like okay i was doing something you know great so imagine having to be so excited about 100 views like ever my first 100 views i bought myself a bowl of ice cream I think 2008 for me was a year I actually, you know, tried with the whole consistency thing. Then fast forward to 2019, I can remember in January, I, I was, I was, you know, there was a text I composed I was going to share on my WhatsApp status to my contacts, you know, begging them to help me get to 500 subscribers. I'm going to put the picture somewhere here. You guys, it was funny. It was when I, I think it was sometime last week that I was going through my notes and I found this note. I was like, ah. 
January 2019. I was begging people, like, I was legit begging people, please so help me subscribe to my channel and get me to 500 subscribers. 2019 was like a total break for me because I had to go to fashion school and, you know, the whole relocation, the whole plans for relocation started, you know, getting pretty, pretty tight and pretty serious. So I didn't have time. For youtube youtube was even wasn't even on top of my head but one thing i know i did because i know how bad and how much i struggled every time i went off you know went away and wanted to come back to youtube what i did in 2019 mostly was do big brother nigeria videos and baby niger videos were videos that i could even do in my sleep you know i could do it in the bus i could do it in the keke i could do it you know in the uber ride i could do it in the i could do it anywhere i could do it while having my bath so it wasn't so much of a struggle so it wasn't so much of a big deal but i needed to stay relevant because at that time big brother nigeria was you know was raining and a lot of people were churning out content it wasn't you know my niche because my niche was beauty but i knew i needed to do something to keep my channel relevant so that when i come back i don't start from ground zero so that was actually what i basically did in 2019 you know and i got married i shared my wedding videos so my views in 2019 wasn't so bad even my watch time for 2019 wasn't so bad so there and then i already told myself that it was 2020 i was going to work hard in 2000 and july of 2019 i got 1000 subscribers that was when i hit the first threshold and you know i did <sighs> okay let us continue looking for 4,000 watch hours that's actually what i did even if i wasn't you know uploading regular beauty content and makeup tutorials so i did things to stay relevant i did things to stay on top of my game but anyways i told myself that when this whole you know when i'm done with fashion school and when i eventually relocate i'm going to take my channel really serious so january 2020 i already gave myself a target that by summer this year i was going to be monetized by god's grace and i put in so much so much so much work into my channel like the amount of work i've put into my channel from january to this present time i don't think i have ever you know put in that much work into my channel since i started youtube in 2000 or since i started uploading videos in 2016. so i told myself no more inconsistency you know i started doing more research you know quality content doing you know finding out more about seo tagging rights you know all the things you need to do to grow your youtube channel that was it for me every freaking day 2020. fast forward to tuesday that was um I don't know when this video is going to go up if this video is going to go up thursday that means it was day before yesterday so tuesday i checked my monetization page and i saw that i had like the three the three steps to you know apply for monetization was already on my monetization page so i couldn't see the whole watch time watch time countdown and the subscribers countdown for the threshold I screamed like I woke up in the morning because I had been, you know, monitoring my watch time back and forth, back and forth, back and forth when I knew I was almost close to my 4,000 watch hours. And that morning, I just decided to check and I saw that, oh, the countdown for watch time and the countdown for um, subscribers was no longer there. And I all I saw was one, two, three steps. The first one was um, apply to the YouTube Partners Program, which I already did. It said done apply for adsense which i already did said done because i have i had i have an adsense account or I actually opened an adsense account i think in 2016 when i used to blog so i already you know linked it to my youtube channel in 2017 so imagine <laughs> so then the third one was my channel was in review that was tuesday in the morning i didn't really want to say anything because i always hear that people say that youtube would always send you an email so i i I hadn't gotten my email. I didn't want to say anything. I didn't want to use my own hand, you know, to spoil my destiny. So I said, let me just keep quiet whenever YouTube sends me the mail. So yesterday at about 3.26 p.m. Canadian time, the email came and the way I screamed, <laughs> I was like, oh, finally the email has come. Okay. In my mind, I was like, yeah, let the waiting period begin because I know and I have heard and I've read that you know sometimes this wait period for your review to you know be approved you takes a lot a long time but according to youtube i think it's the default um 
wait time is really 30 days but i know of people who have waited for three months before they got monetized i know of people who have you know waited for seven months i know of people who have waited for nine months i know of people who have waited for six months before their review was approved and in my mind when i got the email i was like okay let the waiting time begin like let the waiting time begin so i was just gingerly editing my video and when it was like 5 26 i saw another email like as soon as i saw it on my home screen i as in I didn't believe it. I had to open. I had to unlock my phone, you know, and open the email and I saw it and I screamed and I told my husband, I was like, babe, I've been approved. Like, I couldn't breathe. I literally couldn't breathe yesterday. Ah, like my heart was, my heart was, it's like, it was filled with so much joy. Like, I couldn't breathe. I had to send a screenshot to my friend, Dio Bunny. I was like, I can't breathe. I can't breathe. <laughs> I can't be like I couldn't believe it. I got the mail for for reaching my threshold at 3:26 p.m. Wednesday, and at 5:26 p.m. I got another mail that my channel has been approved for monetization. I can go to my YouTube studio and monetize all my videos. <sighs> ah. <laughs> Like, I couldn't believe it. I had lately, because of the whole thing going about, you know, YouTube has been approving channels in days, in two weeks. I even had to chat one of my friends and she said she got her approval in three days. I was like, okay, well, give or take, let me just wait. And mine came in, I would say in 24 hours because if I was judging by the email YouTube sent, YouTube sent an email and two hours later, they sent an email for the approval but if i'm going to be judging by my monetization tab which happened on tuesday morning and i got an approval on wednesday evening i would say it's pretty much about 24 hours so i was like ah, that was so fast has it even the opening was like sure i told you sure i told you don't be surprised this thing is going to happen sure i told you as in i was so super super excited ah, like i didn't know how to act i didn't know how to arrange my body i <laughs> i was so grateful to god you know i knelt down i started praying i started thanking god like finally all my hard work you know you know all my hard work everything i put into this channel like i'm i'm going to start seeing you know the benefits i'm going to start seeing the fruit i'm going to start seeing the results and guys i am using this means to beg I beg, Edjo, Biko, please. If we used to skip ads before, when you come to my channel and when you're watching my videos, please don't skip my ads. Don't skip my ads. Watch my ads because that way, you know, your girl is able to make a little something you know of our youtube channel that way i'll be able to you know i'll be able to invest back into my channel you know um to bring you guys juicy content on all levels you know the whole package guys like i'm really really grateful to god and one thing i'm going to say one thing i'm going to say is do whatever works for you hard work pays the moment i started taking my youtube channel serious that was when my youtube channel started taking me serious that's just the gospel truth there's no way there's no other way i can say it i cannot sugarcoat it when i was serious you know when i was consistent when i was being intentional you know about the kind of uploads on my channel about my video quality about you know sounds about everything that was when i started seeing like the main results on my channel so if you can be consistent with your uploads if you can upload three times a week fine and good because you know you want the watch time you know you want the watch hours and the more you upload videos the more your watch hours or watch time counts and ensure that you're not just uploading videos for upload sake ensure that these videos are going to be pretty engaging to your audience so that your audience retention can be longer when your audience retention is longer or when your audience retention is long then you know that your watch time is also going to be increasing 
day by day another thing i know i did to grow my numbers was i tried to network with other youtubers especially youtubers within my sub count so even when i was at 500 subscribers and i was trying to grow to a thousand subscribers i was mainly networking you know with youtubers within 500 700 300 1000 you know sub count range i was going to their channel watching their videos dropping comments you need to be intentional about these things i was dropping you know meaningful comments not hey nice video thanks for sharing thanks for watching no you need to watch the video you need to make your comments reasonable and when you do this once there's no how someone who is within the same sub count as you will not notice you because he or she also wants to grow that was basically what i did i'm really grateful to i'm really grateful to god i'm grateful to you guys i'm grateful to my 1700 plus subscribers thank you so much you guys are the real mvps i'm grateful to my family i'm also grateful to my husband who has you know been encouraging in his own little way i'm grateful to my friends you know my friends jennifer of sugar's realm tife of a bookish pair i'm grateful of grateful to the ubani she has been super 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 helpful i'm also grateful to my cc family you guys know yourselves i don't have to mention your name one by one you guys know yourself i'm grateful to tammy thank you so much for letting me into your space and into your circle when you don't even know the real me like i can't remember whose channel i was watching and i stumbled upon her and you know i reached out to her and ever since she's been amazing let me just put it that way she doesn't know me from anywhere i don't know her from anywhere but she has been helpful and she has been amazing grateful to you all my subscribers to those who are not subscribed to my channel as well but you watch my video because youtube actually tells me people who watch my videos the more are people who are not subscribed to my channel so i am grateful to you guys that watch my videos and are not subscribed to my channel thank you all so much like i said your girl is now monetized don't forget don't forget please don't skip ads watch ads and help this little girl help this growing channel keep growing i hope you guys enjoyed this video i'll see you all in my next video do have a fabulous 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 day ahead guys bye